uh, yeah first of all uh, a very good evening everyone <clears throat> i welcome you all for this uh, aws solutions architect training program so uh, let me just recap what we have spoken us today <clears throat> yesterday we were going through uh, one of the additional service uh, that is uh, uh, the containerization of the ecs and uh, ecr and ecs so elastic container registry and elastic container uh, service so we spoke about uh, the background engine that is the dockers so how dockers play a very very important role in your creation of your uh, registry and as well as your container so <clears throat> this doesn't come under fritter and it is only a very very uh, what we call as a, a nominal service for us to learn and uh, for solutions architect maybe in future these things will be uh, becoming very very important and uh, this topic is also very important i'm not saying the, it's not important it's very important but in exam you may not get much much that is uh, the thing which i was so yesterday i have gone through the video of uh, how this uh, registry of uh, ecr ecr and ecs especially uh, the <clears throat> the docker service how it will play a very very important role so initially you need to basically like we all know about ami the same procedure also here you can create your uh, uh, what we call as an image docker image if it is already readily available you can use the docker images so the creation of docker images is uh, quite uh, similar to your ami <clears throat> but it is different a third party service this is a docker service which is a very very important part in your uh, what we call as the your devops so we spoke about the docker engine and then we also spoke about how you can install the docker service in your ec2 linux uh, ubuntu server or maybe any linux server and then you can say see the docker status it is uh, it should be running so once this is done once this is done you can uh, basically install uh, your services so we learned about the script of course, script also i have shown you the script inside the document itself so if you run the script in uh, the what we call is uh, in the file uh, so automatically automatically you can verify whether your uh, hello is that uh, yeah i think we lost uh, yeah, the yeah. Yeah, we can't hear you. Yeah, now you can hear me. Yeah, we can hear you. Okay, I think there was a network drop, uh, so I think uh, I got disconnected in between. Anyway, so I was just explaining about what we have learned yesterday. <clears throat> so the important thing of uh, the Docker, the Docker. So the procedure of how you can create a Docker image, I was explaining. So once you are basically you have you are ready with your web server or whatever it is, the image. the application once you are ready with the application you can uh, basically run the docker image so it will create a docker image okay so that image uh, can be even uh, what we call as uh, you will get a url also uri we call as uri so with that uri you can basically deploy the docker run images docker run images that is for the first part 
and now coming to the part of your elastic container registry so elastic container registry is an amazon service so what you can do is that you can create an elastic registry and then add this images docker images into your elastic container registry so this is again very very important once you add the images all the images are uploaded into your ecr ecr so once this ecr is ready you can see the list of images also you can see in the ecr service itself so that the, the image also or the uh, re registry also you will get a uri also please remember uri is very very important so what you can do is that once you deploy your container service so container service you have two options two options one is you can use container service using an ec2 or even without ec2 also you can use uh, uh, this uh, container <clears throat> that is kind uh, serverless serverless you can use ec2 server or serverless so fargate is the container uh, serverless uh, container so we understood about that yesterday the differentiation between server and serverless <clears throat> so if your ser service is too critical or too uh, i mean uh, then you can use a container because that uh, is a bit uh, charges also will be there so for containerless it will be uh, deployed in a shared pool so we saw about the containerless and uh, fargate how you can deploy once it is deployed you can ready to test whether your web server is running or not you will get an ip address so with that ip address you can verify whether that is the thing which i have shown you and else we have also done one of the kc uh, i think the 13th one if i remember correctly which we have left so that part which is which includes your uh, container registry container service plus your lambda services so there are 10 questions we did that particular thing so any questions from any any uh, of members uh, please ask me i also shared the recordings of uh, yesterday's thing of how the ecr and ecs part which is there yeah yesterday i think some of the members could not join because of uh, uh, the change in the invite link uh, earlier it was uh, i think uh, was given up to second so i extended up to seventh that is uh, uh, yesterday and today also was included so because of that i think some mis uh, some the url mishap was happened some of you got the invite and some of you didn't get so maybe because of that but for those people i think uh, i have given the safe side of the recording part which we have done in the class <coughs> yeah Sir, any I questions yeah i yes. want to see the, the recording section and the recording uh, session that you have uploaded i think that is the only one part you remember that uh, we have dropped and uh, reconnected second part i didn't include because that was only the kc part which is there okay Okay. Ha, huh, the yeah. KC part is there. If anyone wants the solutions, yes, I can share the solutions. Sir. Okay. Right, because many of you has already completed. Mm -hmm. Okay. Ha, huh, that and part I is uh, only because of the KC. I didn't upload that particular part. Okay. And uh, and and uh, maybe it, as uh, your communication that uh, today is the last session for us. Yes, so, yes. Uh, uh, that was also an important thing. Today we will have a review session of all the things. If there are any quick questions, we can ask. And also how you have to prepare for the exam. And also completion of your uh, uh, canvas is also very very important. <clears throat> so I just wanted to say that um, uh, I think uh, the notes part is still uh, pending. I uh, <laughs> I'll, I'll upload now itself. I'll upload yeah, now. Yeah. I'll do that. I'll do that uh, today. Whatever is the thing today, we will finish off yeah. that part. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah. Anything else of yesterday's session? You can ask me questions. So, container, you will get one or two questions. So, as I mentioned, they may ask you about the Fargate. That is the question which I saw. Uh, as I mentioned multiple times about the examination point of view, uh, you, a very, very important also exam once you completion of your training. My suggestion is that uh, maximum a month's time. you plan accordingly for the exam plan accordingly preparation is a must preparation is a must for your exam <clears throat> once you are qualified then you will get a certificate from directly from amazon itself but the thing is that now c03 has come just you have to be very cautious i am not saying that it is uh, uh, it is difficult it is you have to be cautious because the question patterns uh, the question styles may change may change but as and when i get an update i promise you i'll be sharing those things to you all so that is uh, regarding the exam but still the domains are same the four domains 
the weightage itself has some small differences which are there the syllabus is exactly the same no change in syllabus one second please <clears throat> yeah, I'm sorry. <clears throat> Here we are. Uh, re re regarding the exam part, very, very important. So there, there are certain things which are there. I just wanted to uh, share those uh, things uh, before the exam. I think I hope you all can see my shared desktop. Yes, sir. Okay. So the thing is that for the members who wants to write for the exam, there is a session number 19. You can see this one. Session number 20 is for students who want to do internship project first. There are some projects. It's not mandated for anyone. Session 21 is all the worker labs recordings. Other than your cases, rest all things are there. Cases are not part of this particular one. You can see this one guided labs are there, the complete guided labs. You can see all modules which are there recordings <clears throat> and also uh, labs with uh, some notes is also challenge labs also is there. All the labs which are there. I'm not saying that you go through immediately. If you are facing any difficulty, you can go through that. All the recordings you can download and do the recording part. Uh, you can. So this capstone project is also there. So uh, I, as I promised, you, there is a recording of capstone also. There is a recording of capstone project and also the documentation in this particular one. The code, everything is here. Uh, recording is also available in uh, what is this uh, YouTube channel. But if all of you are ready, then I can demonstrate that that particular one. So here in the YouTube channel, you can see this particular one. The last I think you can see where is that? Yeah, there is a capstone project. I'll say control F. Yeah, about 46 minutes video is there. The entire demonstration of this particular project is there here. My suggestion is that preview. I'm not saying that you do it. If you are happy, satisfied, then you can start doing the last part, which is there here. You can see this one, the last part, which is there. Uh, where is that? That is module 14, module 15. No, module 14. You can see this particular one. No, module 15. Yeah, capstone project, which is there here. In this particular one, module 15, you have major one is capstone uh, project. So this, the recording is already here. Please preview. Once, if you want me to demonstrate, yes, I can demonstrate if all of you are ready. With, because I'll see the grades and if you all have completed all the things, then uh, fantastic, I can demonstrate once for, for all of you how to proceed this particular one. So, but please complete all these labs because none of you has really initiated all these labs. You see this one, uh, not even guided labs, not even challenge labs are not uh, shown here in any of these things. So please start working on all those things. So major advantage is that if you finish off all these things, you will get a completion certificate also, completion certificate also in the modules. Okay, so that is one thing which is uh, advantages for all of you. Uh, the certificate and also you'll get a digital logo also digital uh, badge also you see this one digital badge claim you'll get that so those things also will be highly advantageous for you so this will be in your uh, sessions 21 once if you complete all these things uh, this worker labs will be there now coming back to sessions 19 sessions 19 is very very important for all of you so which contains lot of lot of information lot of lot of information as i tell you so here also <clears throat> So you have this examination information. So the dumps are there in cloud practitioner and also solutions architect here. See this, uh, what we call it, this sessions folder access, which is given to you. I will uh, this, you see this is the month of September. I'll give up to the September 30th and afterwards I may remove access to all of you. So please be careful by the time you can download all the things, whichever of the things which you want. And in case anything else is needed, I can always post you in this particular, what we call as a, uh, 
uh, WhatsApp group, or you can ask me also any references. So now let me tell you, uh, if if certain members who wants only an outline of the examination point, you can do this cloud practitioner. Practitioner, I'm not. I'm say our topics includes both. Solutions architect is much higher level than cloud practitioner. So you tell me. Once you complete all the things, I can organize voucher accordingly. Cloud practitioner and solutions architect, either of one, not two. So only once I can organize the voucher. That is uh, as part of the curriculum. Okay. So now this there is the third folder which you can see. This is called as the exam information and your certificate. So there is a PowerPoint presentation. You can see how to sign for the examination. How to sign for the examination. You can see this particular one. Very simple PowerPoint presentation which is created by me. Okay, <clears throat> this particular one, and also uh, scheduling. There is a documentation file. Also, both things are same. Similar one. You can see this particular one. Go to the website AWS dot training, and then see here all the red things which I have highlighted over there. So you can see this particular one. Once you sign in, once you sign in, you can select your examination, which examination you want. Uh, yeah, go to your certification account. This is your certification account. So manage peers and VU exam. And then minus Pearson VU exams, which is there. You can click that. You can select which exam you want. Solutions architect or practitioner. The solutions architect is here. Once you select that, automatic. Yeah. Uh, we have completed cloud practitioner exam. So can we have a practice examination on the AWS website? Sorry, certification. Because we have completed cloud practitioner I agree. they have given in their website that uh, if you have completed only uh, minimum one exam then you can uh, open up uh, that uh, practice exam practice yeah, if it is available practice AWS. exam you can try yeah you will get one uh, avail applicable voucher also practice exam contains 30 questions or something you can try that you will get one time eligibility okay okay you can do that I think for uh, practitioner at uh, the practice exam, I have kept it in the video recording for practitioner. If anyone wants to see model questions of uh, how the practice similar things will be available for uh, your uh, what we call as uh, solutions. And yeah, this demo exam, you see this one AWS cloud practitioner demo like that you get free of cost for uh, solutions architect. So there are about 30 questions. I think in this particular one, I just made a recording. Uh, for practice. If it's your dream to work at a man company, just a second. all you need is to register for this free masterclass. Like that, you will get eligibility for uh, solutions architect also. Sir, like, uh, hello. Yeah, Sir, if you already have any, like, we have already cleared this practitioner exam and have a right, voucher right, right. for uh, higher exam, a 50% mm -hmm. voucher for higher exam. So, how can we use this? voucher that we will get from this program how can we use yeah that's what i was showing the presentation so you need to basically select this particular one how to use the voucher only i'm showing in this presentation okay so this aws uh, solutions architect architect associate you have to select that once you select which test and then you want to do online test center or any visiting a test center also you can uh, select accordingly so after that selection uh, after that selection, you have to agree all the things which English and the other things also are quite uh, simple. Once you you need to pay cloud practitioner is hundred dollars solutions architect is one fifty dollars. So once you are ready, you can select your proctor to speak that is English. Select your date and time. Once this is done, you need to pay the bill. So it will it will come proceed to checkout. So this is your final bill value. So <clears throat> this is the policies. I just say accept. And here uh, with the tax, it comes to 119. If it is 150 plus tax, that is uh, something like uh, uh, $27, uh, 177 something you'll get. So here you need to apply your voucher code. Here you need to apply your voucher, the thing which I'm giving. Automatically, when you apply the voucher here, this will be divided into two, half. So if you are writing practitioner, it will come to 59, I think, 59. If you are writing solutions mm -hmm. architect, then it will come to uh, 177 divided by 2, something like that you'll get. So 70, 80, 80, uh, 84, 84 US dollars. That will be the price. You need to pay, pay that. So this is a promotional voucher, which is non-transferable. It means that you will, you will only get. Once the voucher comes, one year validity will be there, the voucher. 
okay so you have to enter your card details whatever it is once it is done <coughs> give all the things so you will get an email from uh, the test center pearson so you one mail for your invoice invoice received and second is that instructions for the exam how to take the exam how to go to the test center what all you need to carry all your everything a long mail you will get with all details if you are working from home or <clears throat> if you want to write it from home remote how to test all the things also will be equipment will be done will be given so once you go to the test center or you my suggestion is that go to the test center and write my suggestion uh, until unless if you have a very very strong reasons that you may not because there are many people who report problems if they are writing from home so you should have a strong ups you should have a strong uh, uh, bandwidth all these things it should not flicker uh, if you manage all those things okay otherwise uh, my suggestion go to the test center and write relax you can write no need to think about all those things before uh, see even one uh, people one member said that someone has shouted from a second room immediately this fellow has cancelled the exam like that in a different room someone has shouted so he has uh, someone is shouting I, I will not accept in that way uh, it happens like that so uh, you have to again buy full voucher and then write the exam it's very tough so once this uh, this is done once the exam is submitted completed you get immediate result but nowadays they are not giving immediate result they are not telling you pass or fail also they will say <clears throat> that you have written the exam so 700 for practitioner 750 for SAA so result will be coming maybe a day time maybe a day time earlier they used to tell at least pass or fail so go to your certification portal and download your what you call as your score report after a day's time okay you can go through and also you can download the certificate which is valid for three years so yeah you also get some benefits also uh, the benefits yes you can see this benefit is that uh, so you can redeem your uh, the selection in the certification itself you can get your benefits also so one is uh, your pass certificate you can download see you see there are a number of benefits you get 50 percent discounted voucher for the next exam that is one and also you get a practice exam benefit also you get so there is a voucher for that you need to and i think there are some um, you can buy certain things i think you can get store benefits also are there so that is not major but 50 percent discount you'll get for the next exam and that is valid again for three years three years so that voucher but what the voucher which i am giving is only for one year is this clear any questions in this particular one exam signing in process this is there already you can download the process this is the uh, this thing which is there so you can uh, keep up your certificates <clears throat> so once you complete this one once you complete uh, what we call as the course you will get also the badge and also a certificate so the certificate looks something like uh, i'll show you this is instructor badge logo yeah something like this you'll get 40 hours of training from issued on so and so date digital badge also you'll get a credibly so this is the one so you can even push it into publish in linkedin etc also so badge also will be this is your certificate badge okay uh, where is that so this type of credentials you will get you will get educator this is educator but uh, some logos also will be there some logos also will be there you can get all those things for you yeah logos here you can see this one and that is a you can verify the logos also uh, for uh, whatever is the things which you really work across yeah solutions are created so said and you can publish so these are the benefits which you are going to get once you complete your exam and you get exam transcripts also you can download that exam transcript like this you can see i'll tell you for solutions architect associate like yeah like this you get your score uh, this is my solutions architect associate i think i got 79 percent this is a re, re uh, second uh, second uh, this thing so after three years your uh, certificate will expire you have to again write the exam this is my second uh, exam uh, rating 2014 was the initial uh, no 17 i think 20 or 21 i think i wrote once again so another three years you will get valid so this is how you get that exam transcript 720 is the passing score 720 is the passing score like this you can see for for any exam you will get uh, something like this uh, this is a practitioner i think this one yeah practitioner 
<clears throat> oh, yeah, like this. So for how, whatever exams you clear, you will get it. You will get it. This one is my developer exam. I just passed border. I tell you, even if I would have done one mistake, I would have lost. One mistake, 720, 724, I got. One mistake would have given a huge pain for me. So this is your certificate information. If you want anything else, you can ask me. So these are all uh, uh, about AWS certifications. Okay, uh, yeah. That is exam information. Very, very important for all of you. So additional reference books, if you want. Yes, I had kept it here. You can see here. Yeah, uh, hello everyone. Can you listen my voice? Yes, sir. We can hear you. Okay, you I don't know why you. the signal has dropped all of a sudden. The my net, I mean, internet signal. Uh, 
maybe sometime it happens sir <laughs> from the <laughs> from the server itself normally it doesn't happen rs is a fiber line uh, i don't know why i don't know why anyway let me not waste my time uh, i'll just share my desktop so i was just giving the examination uh, what we call as uh, uh, information how you can uh, basically get into the write the examination etc I, i just go to so uh, yeah i was showing you some reference books please you can go through these reference books which are there pearson migra hill and a exam guide etc etc this is another important thing which will be helpful for you for your uh, uh learning methodology learning methodology so this is all if you want to write any papers or publications or something you can take this references theory notes for each and every domain you have some notes which is there additional uh, reading notes if you are preparing the word uh, content is also there word in uh, the same thing will be there in word also so that is uh, the theoretical aspect of your notes and most important is your interview questions i i see in this particular group there are some people who are students so if you are going for any uh, if you are especially in the final year you will get some lot of opportunities related to uh, amazon web services okay so cloud <clears throat> so there are some interview questions also please go through this one very 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 important i tell you so straight questions straight answers you need to answer and then you can give something else also but these are the short notes for each and every questions which are there what is what do you understand by cloud so not only for the interviews even for uh not uh, for your uh, uh, i mean explanation purpose or even for uh, making them understand or something like that you can always definitely help uh, uh, the what are the advantage these are very very generic questions very generic questions uh, of using the entirely this is not aws this is cloud okay mention some platforms which efficiently how mobile computing is different than cloud computing what are the different types of uh, layers in cloud computing iasps so write some security laws that are so and so so some questions are there some 15 20 questions are there please go through learn these things if you face any difficulties in understanding i am there to help you or to make more and more uh, technically uh, sound excel what are the difference between scalability elasticity about 20 questions are there for this uh, cloud so you see this one top aws architect interview questions there are layers in this questions which are there you can just download this one and then go through top 90 aws questions which are there 2021 questions number of uh, questions which are there this is now query learning okay so just download auto scaling types of cloud services some of the things you have learned many things what is ami just go through so questions from because these people collect all these things and publish accordingly so i just kept it for your ready reference these are nothing which is called as copy protected so you can start run learning these things if you are facing any difficulty let me know so this is one you see last year questions these are all interview questions which is their interview bit so here also easy questions are there basic questions advanced questions is there uh, advanced aws questions so with solutions also are there you can see the basic interview what is ec2 what is snowball like that cloud watch okay please go through all these things please go through so how can you send a request to s3 what does ami include what are the different type of instances we covered all these things what is the relation between availability zone and a region what do you meant by vpc okay what different type of ec2 instances based on their costs how do you understand stopping and terminating what is the consistency models of modern db eventual consistency strong as we learned about all these things in db what is geo targeting in cloud front okay so please go through this one so yeah some questions 2021 is available here still more are there basic cloud computing interview questions cloud interview questions and top 90 interview questions you can go through any of these interview questions still more if there are anything i can place it on there i think this is the notes part which i have created i'll update this particular one <clears throat> so last i think about one week 10 days i have not written anything uh, you can understand yeah this is the notes july 22 final one Yes, Shashank, I have updated. You can use and download. Thank you, sir. Thank you so much. Right, it is there in sessions 19 notes. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So, sir. right. Thank you. Yeah, Rubina, you wanted to say something. Sir, can we store our project in uh, GitHub? This project, Capstone project. 
because we need to i need to show up in my room that way capstone project you do that you do that that is always good right you want no, to can we store it in github which one capstone project because i i am not that much familiar with github or you want to make it public or private uh, if, if private 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 you can do whatever you want you can download and do what public means some comments will be there some nuisance will be there that you have to face you have to be careful okay. until unless uh, uh, you are very sure public means that everyone will get access they'll ask you questions you need to answer otherwise they'll write some nuisance on uh, your box okay other than no, that it nothing will be private issues. i i need to show up uh, in my resume that's why show that no problem do very well that is okay there is nothing what i have done is proprietary you can always use it whatever i teach or whatever i show everything is public no uh, nothing which is uh, restricted okay so can we have more projects uh, other than this that's one to do only that's what i was saying there yeah, is it's a, one project only no not one project that is there in the capstone is there here in okay. this particular one which one here this is sandbox project i mean sorry canvas mm. project but if you want to do projects you can have several projects which are there that's what i will say go to sessions 20 okay so go to sessions 20 project work is there optional see this rubina yes okay so but here how you to see do this do it i don't know i am listen listen carefully don't be in a hurry i am explaining for okay. you one right okay see there are some project guidelines here dot txt format also this is actually for the people who are doing internships i generally give guidance and all the things are very clear written very thing is completely written by my own uh, these things only how you generally select your project maximum four members all projects should be on cloud okay outputs screenshots so and so how many number of pages each and everything is uh, i have given suggested projects here i have given here what type of virtual private cloud deploying infrastructure on private cloud and connecting resources using secure keys route 53 based load balancer based cloud formation ops service lambda or even rds i have given an outline here suggestion so if you want so to get it a it needs maximum sorry it needs four people actually i don't want to i don't I'm have saying, anyone i will i am saying i am saying suggested okay one said you are asking me how to do and the other said you are asking me four people where do i get no no i don't want four people i will do it myself by myself see, this is, is only problem. guidelines suggested guidelines this is for internship not for project uh, see project internship not for uh, but if you want to do how to do i am explaining is this clear yeah so can we consider this course as an internship no internship means you have to have a guidance but if you want to gain experience you can use these things internship means they will ask for certificate and all these things also okay yes. <clears throat> but if you want to do projects you can do this project okay so that's why i have i'm showing you like capstone project is there you asked about projects i'm saying about the projects so yeah mini project guidelines this is you see this one there is a dra draft also one member has done like you can see here how she has done uh, the abstract the procedure in the introduction how it has been done this you can take it as a reference and you have to do the project it's not that exactly same to same needs to be there if that is there then there is no need of doing the project so you see the outputs and how she has done okay there is only a general guidance a general guidance okay and finally how uh, this is uh, deployed etc will also be there this some mini projects which are there you can see here out 53 is also one member has done <clears throat> see this one just for your an idea i am giving you all these things just for an idea and where do you get the code so here you have all the codes code is available no no not this not this this is only a certificate so here you see this one generic project code is there so the projects all these are codes only if you want to do see one for one of the uh, thing i have done the demonstration how to do this project news portal is there dot zip file 
you can download this code from here here you can see this uh, how to do the project is done here how to do the project project guidance i cannot keep all the projects and do it uh, what else they will do see here you see this one news portal about 20 minutes uh, 17 and a half minutes on aws windows server how to deploy this particular project this project is if it's your dream to work at a man company all you need is to register for this free master class and important one which i wanted to show you a project preview see uh, the other day also I was for uh, one of the project i was demonstrating so i will be showing you a demonstration uh, on how you can uh, create a, a lab exam server and deploy a web a deploy connect to the website connect to the website a project which is there about like a news portal or hotel management or maybe anything which is there are I'm many things hotel management how to deploy that lab so this will be helpful for you because this is a windows HRM, server we far need far. to deploy this mysql ph so this is the live demonstrations you can go through this one how to deploy i'll name this and all the complete some... project lamp server like this small icon so this is on uh, windows server okay, you can see this defender firewall Uh, just click that so please go through this one go for finally what you will see you will see the output like this that the project is ready everything there is a database file you go to news portal so the website should function yeah this is your project news portal so i'm just giving a guest uh, sheet it should be attached to your what we call as uh, your mysql server sir uh, how did you build this website you Are see you this using video which technologies you see this video completely you will understand the lamp lamp is there right linux apache mysql php okay so you can in uh, mysql you can see the uh, the what we call as uh, the, the guest sheet you need to see that the database has been populated ha huh? it has come so this is the thing a nice article i mentioned that it has come over here if this is there it is the po the posts are coming across this is clear so this is not mandate optional if you want to do you can do the code is available sorry the code is available here in this one so i have one another question jam I think we lost him. Yeah, uh, again I lost and I got connected. Uh, can you hear my voice? Yes, sir. Okay, okay. Uh, again, once again, I'll share. So, what I mean to say related to projects is uh, uh, like uh, you can basically select your project. See, normally no one will give you the code. They charge a huge money for the code. Okay, but I am giving you all the code for each and every. The zip file will contain everything. How to deploy from this code at news portal? I had demonstrated here. If you want to do it on Linux server, yes, you can on Ubuntu server. Yes, on Linux server also. So the sample of one of the project I have given here, one of the project. Okay, 
so this is purely for your benefit for your benefit if i float for internship training programs then i can give you some suggestions and all these things but this is only only training program this is only a normal training program okay so here as i was showing you there is there are some demonstrations also so here you can see this particular one on ubuntu server also you have this particular one setting up exam server on ubuntu the same project similar project you can now uh, that you are here start your website with hostinger today fast loading efficient support so hello uh, and you can deploy your code that? accordingly and deploy your code accordingly you can see this one the same one easy to instance on ubuntu server so once this is done a similar one you will see similar one once you get this you have to uh, basically set up your uh, mysql server and of course your uh, php and verify accordingly and then yes, you no. can uh, launch accordingly so all the instructions are very well clearly uh, demonstrated here if you face any additional support yes you can ask me you can ask but you have to work across work across so these are the codes which are there so these are even the links also are available in this projects.txt you can select any one of the thing which is there suppose if i want to set up this medical laboratory management you can see this one there is a url here if you want a detailed notes on some of this particular thing these are campus codes which are there dot com you can just go through that particular link i don't know whether it is uh, existing or not this is not there oh, sorry you are not looking here i think they might have removed this code they might have removed this code you can try with other things which are there so these are the links which are there maybe online project management system let us check let us check if it's not there don't blame me sometimes they keep changing a lot no this one also not found i think they keep on changing but you can see you can go through that if, if it is there if you have any data which is there or not okay this is about this uh, project codes which are there sample project codes guidelines and project uh, codes which are there all right this is about session 20 session 21 already i mentioned about what is this uh, workerm labs the labs part which is there please do all the labs at the earliest you will uh, definitely uh, get your uh, training completion certificate and all this thing and one one more thing which i want to tell all of you one more thing if that is one certificate which you get from what we call as uh, uh, from aws okay as i have shown you the certificate once you complete but if you want a training completion certificate from me from me a digital copy signed by me i can also organize i can also organize a soft copy okay do let me know so not one individually who all members they can put it across with their full name with their full name i have the data but if there is again redoing of certificate means it will be a tough time for me so what we will be giving we will be giving a certificate for your reference for your reference again i say it is for your reference it's not mandate for any, for all but if you want you can have that free of cost digital copy where we can give you the training completion certificate so a preview i can just show you a preview of how, how the certificate looks like uh, where it is regarding clear. this training sir uh, you are talking about the, the training which we had done the same the thing, same thing yeah 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 the same training so see thing is that my suggestion is that do all the exercises you will get certificate from amazon that is for sure and a digital badge which i have shown you the certificate from amazon but there can be some members who doesn't want to do but still they have participated the training they will be given a certificate training from me i can always yeah. give you yeah right so that part which i wanted to show you that part i wanted to show you so here i just show you uh, how the certificates looks like uh, this thing because all the college students university students i generally give a part of that the certificates and all those things yeah like this it should be like this it should be so your name you have to give your name amazon web services solutions architect associate which was held online okay from so and so date to this uh, this is how it looks like this is how it looks like okay is this clear 
this is your training completion certificate this is your training completion certificate it looks like that yeah any 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 other questions sir the projects which you have uh, just walked us through till now mm. that's uh, a code <laughs> yeah yeah code and everything uh, mm. do you suggest us to go through complete uh, list of projects uh, before taking an exam or it's like for math no no no, 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 no not at all that is only for the college students who do wanted to do okay that is nothing related yeah. to solutions architect training at all see some people do ask about uh, once they complete their internship they ask for certain uh, project project means that at least during that particular time they will be doing all the labs that is what is our intention so for the codes and all these things they need not struggle for getting the code i have given the code for them so that they'll have some people i'll ask them to do a website also because most of the people they keep in their resumes about how they have done their project so and so etc etc all these things so the working steps like they i'll tell them okay tell about cloud tell about a service which you are using especially vpc or maybe route 53 or maybe like a latency we generally fail over based we did that right and then create a project you need to create an ec2 instance deploy a website Uh, using sam server or something do a real time domain dns so it is uh, 90% you are by basically demonstrating what exactly you are doing in the industry that is what my intention is so hence they'll ask them to do all this kind of things the uh, if they do like that they'll have a deeper inside knowledge about how the things you have work out in the cloud and everything should be there in the cloud not in their local desktop is this clear raven yeah and uh, the capstan project you are saying like once everyone is ready you will uh, demonstrate the demonstrate capstone. you can so, make a pre if you are good enough you can uh, go through the video also same thing the video also and you can start a trial right but if you want no all of you wants to have a demonstration i can demonstrate i think you the capstan project you said we only have two chances right um, yeah 60 dollars okay right so hence i say that minimum two or three times you go through the uh, video video okay. <laughs> you will understand better so there i had demonstrated using cloud9 cloud9 or ec2 both of them are same okay um, but still you can work across also <clears throat> okay so finally this caption project would you suggest us to do as well uh, watching the video or uh, would are you planning to organize another session you tell me you tell me after <laughs> watching the video will you be comfortable to do I mean, since this is the last class, and uh, we might not, uh, because everyone I, their own pace. No, no, and, no, no, no. Even though this is the last class, we but still we are connected. Uh, that's not what I'm saying, because everyone has their own pace of. Uh, no, no, no. Why I'm saying is that I should not say that I'll teach everything to you. Yeah. If yeah. you have the capacity, no, you have that confidence. I can do. You can do very well. I should appreciate for that. Okay. No, but no, sir. I, I still I'm not getting confidence even after watching two times. Okay, I'll, uh, I'll demonstrate. we can give a one trial right out of two we can at least try one absolutely bike. absolutely that is what my intention so if everything is done in a spoon feeding way when will you get a chance to do exactly yeah uh, some people will ask a chance to do so though you have only one project to do that if i completely demonstrated then uh, what else is there so that's a video is there you know maximum hits are going only for that particular video in my capstone project only maximum number of hits okay and uh, this academy access uh, you said you would be giving up to this month end september 30th sorry right? sorry academy access aws academy access the one lab this particular lab. one ah okay i think up to what time i have given now i'm not sure uh... let me check let me check september 15th i have given so i will extend now itself okay maybe up to september 30 i'll give uh i would ask you to do another 15 days because uh, you ask me on that day i'll i'll extend okay okay fine yeah. if i give you now <laughs> you know what happens right <coughs> okay you'll ask again on october 15 another 15 days okay and uh, uh, the last question from me sir the class recordings which you have been sharing uh, the youtube links would you be letting the access available for us uh, for a longer duration uh, youtube or? is free for everyone okay. lifetime thank you thank you yeah lifetime <clears throat> you can make use 
so uh, that is not no restrictions only for yourself and even for future people uh, also i made plan. it like that i made it like that see okay. my intention is that education requires some element element of charges but it should not be made as a business that is no, my no. intention always so okay. for that itself i make all the things i make all the things so see i have given almost all the videos of uh, what we call as uh, uh, in the classroom free of cost there is no charges but some people may do or learn and then they again ask me they want to join in the next batch something like that they come in that particular way also that is also one advantage for them because they'll make a preview and then they are coming seriously interested people will come that is one second thing is that if you want to learn other technologies why should you invest huge no not not required i am giving the documentation i am giving the way of doing the exercises etc maybe uh, a small reference book you can download or you can buy that is enough i told you you can learn linux you can learn networking you can learn many things even cyber security cyber forensics all the things are there like this for youtube i mean for like this for your aws class sessions i made even for cyber security also i made even for cyber security you can just go through those things also i mean 10 days recordings completely uh, full day recording i mean that is a full day recording which is also available for cyber security so sir actually i am referring to our batch classes correct correct they will also be available that's what you're saying right sorry sorry the uh, sessions which you have given for this particular batch uh, right right those those uh, sessions will also be available in youtube absolutely all from day one onwards the recordings are there yeah <coughs> this one here this is the one i don't know whether it has been shorted you see day one day two day three day four day five like this everything is organized okay well. dates also i have given 19 20 21 22 23 24 i think yesterday was 27 september 5th the complete no modifications are there in these recordings okay so yeah right this is complete class but no sir i want only the labs and all those things there is a separate what we call as uh, uh, what we call as uh, uh, play playlist aws web services where you have devops and uh, of course aws con concepts everything will be there in this so i think there are about 40 videos odd okay uh, yeah i just uh, want to tell you like uh, yeah uh, the cyber security 10 day full training full full hours is there here cyber forensics is also there windows servers is also there if you want to have some awareness you can go through awareness on all these things awareness now i want to have something awareness on uh, uh, other technologies you can go through this particular day. some of the recordings are there you may or you may not get complete information but still you will get something my suggestion please go through for the people who wants to know about certifications i made a video 40 minutes video you see this on importance of it certification this is a fantastic video i tell you it covers more or less major certifications which are going across in the world and some outlines some outlines also are given which one to start how you can proceed various kind of domains and all these things are available in this particular one video 40 minutes video you will get a complete eye opener some people will say yeah hey, you do this certification some people will say you do that but you should know what is that really so this video will tell you majority of this it certifications are there here this particular one okay that is also one of the important thing and if you want to learn my suggestion is please go through this zero zero things very very essential see here this one network essentials very very important 40 minutes see the documentation is also available some people will ask me sir i want to learn about basics of networking how to start this is important even if you are going for cloud interviews learn this network essentials because without knowing about tcp ip you cannot explain about vpc or route 53 in depth a lot so if you want to learn, know about the terminology about network in terms i have given a google drive link also just get into that you will get a pdf document of all the network terms many people say that after knowing all this is they have cleared the interviews they have cleared the interviews so in a nutshell i have given see if any question is asked if any question is asked what is ipsec rather than keeping quiet at least say one line at least say one line the interviewers will feel happy ah oh, you said something okay 
if you are good enough you can explain uh, elaborate a little bit more elaborate a little bit more all almost all alphabetically this has been organized alphabetically just uh, two lines three lines also is okay rather than uh, keeping our uh, what we call as uh, uh, keeping quiet okay so this is network essentials these are relatedly related your cloud cyber security networking is essential core essential topics i tell everyone i tell everyone last uh, i think uh, uh, thursday friday uh, saturday three days i was giving uh, uh, an online sessions for uh, vijnan university uh, no not online it is offline i went physically over there uh, really those are all uh, selected people who has come across selected means that uh, shortlisted people so i felt happy because all of them are very eager to get into i don't know how many will uh, seventh is their interview dates i don't know how many people will really get into but but definitely this type of uh, preparations and all those things uh, uh, will always be a big advantage yes a big advantage yes. so my suggestion is like i i just made a preview i'll just show you i don't know whether i have kept it in this particular one or not <clears throat> sometimes i make a recording uh, some people uh, this is at kl university uh, this is vijnan a glimpse uh, this is the one i think last uh, thursday friday saturday three days i was there uh, interview preparation workshop so i think uh, uh, they should be getting a see once they are selected you know how much amazon is going to pay 16 to 17 lakhs network services now not putting this and i did it to limit the part of so i was giving a, a workshop a kind of workshop so it's always and also a kind of uh, uh preparation basically you can see how i i prepared them i used to call one by one and tell ask questions you for an hands slowly slowly talk slowly no problem you are given some time the idea of this transfer enhanced video gateway routing protocol uh, it was first developed by cisco it is used only it was only used in uh, cisco routers but now it has become a standard routing protocol uh, Uh, for all Cisco routers, stand on those words. It works only on Cisco routers. It doesn't work on any other routers, right? So anyway, those things avoid all those things. It is for our internal thing. Yeah, tell in brief. So prepare right? some people who want to come, tell, come across, and then right. I felt very happy because people will become more confident before the examination, before their interview. Routing protocol. so as this less as less as less pv distance vector algorithm you should tell about the algorithm topic using this distance vector algorithm it identifies the neighbors and also every 5 seconds hello packets are sent so that it identifies all the newly generated route or newly new routes or if there is no routers or no routes it So packet switching how it does? Switch. Switch means uh, it has a it may be there is any other switch connected that is the next packet forwarding packet forwarding third function is loop avoidance loop avoidance so whenever during the course of packet forwarding if it's so this provider they asked this was a glimpse basically uh, for the interview preparation uh, we should see the results we should see the results okay i was just showing you uh, this this was my 3 day program which happened last uh, thursday friday saturday yeah any other quick questions from any members so we started a month ago back but uh, we had i think today will be the eighth session of our classroom so
Yeah, hello. Uh, you can hear me. Yes, sir. Okay. Again, another interruption which happened. Yes, sir. Yeah, I think you can sh see my shared desktop, right? Hello. Yes, sir. Okay, 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 fine, fine. Uh, so I, what I was saying is like, uh, yeah, this was the preview of uh, my uh, interview preparation. So my few. Yeah, able to see me? Yes, sir. Okay, so let me uh, um, give all the few important things which are there uh, because I don't know how to how long this connection will be there. <clears throat> so thing is that your preparation should contain three elements. Please remember the first one is the reference book which I have shared. Please go through that important points, important parts very well. Do all the important part, go through all the important points, memorize all the things. I was saying about the interviews thing. Please take even a smaller interviews also as the larger interviews. OK, that is very, very essential. Prepare all the topics very well. See one important thing which I want to tell you in the interviews. If they ask a question, try to think first properly. Even if you don't know answer also completely, try to give at least one line the definition part. The definition part, you should know that and also the advantages and it should have something sense in that. If there is a logic, please tell the logic very clearly. Should have at least at least three to five minutes of answer is appreciable, appreciable. And if you have a solid knowledge, absolutely fine, absolutely fine. So even if you want to choose your higher profile, they'll ask about a lot of lot of use cases, use cases. So you should have a sound knowledge on use cases basically in what way they'll ask you what is the situation you have faced they'll ask you what is the solution which you have done so that's how the solutions architect will be there and you should have good communication skills also if you have both all these things you are the person for all the it companies which has been looked for okay and second thing is that i have already had one of the recording called as azure also please go through that you can sign up for free and then you can go through a sample of some of the thing. I have shown you how to create an instance and how to create a, uh, something as storage and attach something like that. You can see that everything you can learn self. No need to again go through a big, big training programs, nothing like that. And okay. the third one, which I want Data to tell you. Data routes available yeah. over there for register? Sorry? Uh, uh, like, do we have something like free tire? Ah, uh, there also. Tire. But he, there he is giving for one month. Okay. You can go through that, uh, the card and all these things uh, uh, like AWS, uh, uh, what we call as uh, Amazon.com we have, right? So there also you have Azure.com. You can uh, just to sign up the URL also, all these things is there, the one video, about 30 minutes or 40 minutes, you can see that. Same thing, all the things, security groups, all these things are very, very similar. Only the one go, you can understand all the things also. Three, four days classes also, you can do it within one go. My suggestion, please do once, please do once. Whether it is Azure or whether it is Google Cloud or Oracle Cloud, everything is same. You can do that. That is practical point. OK, the third thing which I wanted to say, apart from your no, the reference book and also from your what we call as uh, uh, the important points, you need to go through the dumps very well. Use cases. I would appreciate if all of you sit together, prepare a timing and then start working on the dumps. So I can give you suggestions as needed, but you need to work across. You need to improve your brainstorming skills and you will be the winner. You will be the winner always. The things which you have learned, no doubt cloud practitioner is different. Solutions architect is different. The quality of questions will be much in depth compared to uh, practitioner. And if you go to professional, you will have only use cases. 90% use cases will be there. The question also will come from the top to the bottom. That length of the question will be there. So naturally, all the question and answers looks correct only. 
you have to see the best one to uh, provide the solution so naturally your skills should have at least 2 to 3 years of full knowledgeable experiences okay and that is uh, the good part of that okay preparation 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 is a must for all of you so for the last uh, uh, 28 sessions onwards we, we were going through the day one okay about the demonstration of aws we started with compute we started we gone through storage storage also number of types block storage we have gone through object class i mean s3 storage we have gone through elastic file system we have gone through all the topics are important and afterwards we have gone through the database that's rds dynamo db of course th those are very important for us in dynamo in rds also we have gone through mysql and if you want you can go through the Ar aurora also because questions may come from aurora uh, topics. There is some short notes for Aurora, uh, all these things. And uh, most importantly, Elastic Catch is very important. Elastic Catch, you will get one or two questions. That is more for must. And then uh, you have uh, we have gone through the networking, the uh, uh, technical concept which is there is uh, like your VPC, Route 53, VPN. Of course, all these things are very, very important. And of course, some of the additional components like your, uh, <coughs> I spoke about uh, uh, what is what we call as uh, direct connect etc. Also is part of your networking. Please go through all those things, and then we have gone through the topics related to uh, your uh, what we call as the automation and the cloud formation, <coughs> that beanstalk, then the lambda. We just outlined about the officers. Nothing is there for us, uh, right? And then we have gone through. Uh, some of the uh, additional services so like uh, uh, we have gone through this SQS, SNS and uh, see this, they, these two are uh, uh, what we call as uh, 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 individual uh, services uh, uh, and then we have gone through SES and then as uh, uh, what is that the other service workflow service SWF and then we have gone through CloudWatch, CloudTrail and of course uh, uh, the other components, additional components, we started working like uh, uh, services on uh, what we call uh, uh, what are the services? Windows uh, uh, sharing system. Okay, so what is that the service? The service which shares the file system across Windows and uh, uh, I forgot just now. Okay, so the, that is one of the service, and then like that, a global accelerator. All these things are very, very important. We spoke about Elastic Network Interface. We spoke about uh, uh, Elastic IPs, etc. All these things. FSX service for Windows, we spoke. So these are all uh, some of the important uh, services uh, which we have learned uh, apart from all the six. And additionally, yesterday, day before, we have gone through uh, the services on uh, uh, what we call as uh, the microservices. Uh, uh, we spoke about uh, uh, what is that? Mm, uh, the cloud, the uh, what we call uh, this uh, streaming services, streaming services. Okay, and then in our yesterday, the cloud. Uh, uh, I mean the, the Docker and ECSCCR. So all these services are very very important. If still there are some new services which are coming. Apart from that, we also learned about important thing, the security services also. So please go through that. Well architected framework is very very important course a lot of other services also and plans also we have gone through so if there are anything any questions you have please do not hesitate to ask me so that is again very very uh, advantages for you if you have any questions coming across anyway thing is that as promised i have given you the complete youtube channel uh, access to all the recordings of all the classes the lab access lab also is there so i have extended your uh, uh, canvas up to uh, October 15th, I think uh, October 15th, uh, September 30th. Later on, if you want, I can extend. No problem for that. Please do all the things. Don't keep postponing. Otherwise, it will be postponed. There are two categories of people which I have seen. People who are full with full effort, they will always do on time. And they, if there is any shortage, they will ask extension. People will start at the last minute. So those people are maybe very difficult for them, the success. I'm not saying they, are, they will not be successful. Uh, the success is a little bit distance compared to uh, the people who are preparing uh, regularly. So my suggestion, please prepare things which I wanted to. I just recapped. I thought of uh, uh, going, uh, giving more and more tips, but that's okay. Uh, any quick questions from any any of the members? Please let me know uh, so that we can uh, again keep in touch. Uh, if again my signal goes away, then again I may not be able to answer your questions. 
yeah being today is the last day of our session uh, i i feel that you all had a comfortable time uh, especially for having all the classes and of course your uh, uh, day to day exercises i didn't uh, i suppose that you didn't feel any inconvenience about our sessions except i think we had one or two classes we have postponed other than that we are we have uh, uh, went through almost all the classes as per our schedule should have been completed by last friday but we had taken up to till today uh, yeah any quick questions anyone wants to ask let me know now before we sign off nothing sir from my side uh, but i must say uh, it's a very uh, great and uh, uh, good journey with uh, you uh, and uh, definitely okay. we will keep in touch with you and we will talk uh, not only about aws we have learned lot many things which is uh, currently must or uh, what we can say is like uh, needed uh, to grow yourself and your organizations or uh, for any perspective in, in in your professional growth Mm, is how we can plan our uh, goals and achieve in, in those things are like uh, uh, really helpful for us and uh, it's a really uh, I'm, I'm really thankful to you to give all this information and okay that, can... that was very nice shashank your inputs are very very uh, boosting for me yes definitely uh, i want all of you to have such type of i mean uh, Uh, I, uh, first of all, I want everyone to have a very good and colorful career. So, for that, whatever is the suggestions or thoughts or maybe uh, the things which are input for uh, these things are uh, well appreciated. And I am happy that you did not face any inconvenience during our my classes, and also almost all the classes went through very well. And first of all, I should also thank you all for the support which you have given from day to day. yeah i want anyone else also to give i mean uh, their uh, experience or their journey how it went through and if there are anything which you need me to also uh, improve also yes we can take your feedbacks well if those things are very well appreciated yes please raven you want to say something uh first of all thanks um, for all the knowledge uh, you have shared us uh, it is a pretty good classes actually and uh, we believe uh, we have learned a lot but um, added to that uh, our only personal effort might prove that so yes uh, we appreciate your patience and uh, for bearing with us and uh, sharing us all the knowledge okay thank you thank for you. Uh, yeah. yeah yeah thank you raven uh, it is i should say that uh, i kept you all patient <laughs> <laughs> my thing is only a teaching so i generally cope up whenever i see uh, there are any people i mean students who are knowledge hunger uh, i can't stop myself so many times i generally uh, go boundaries cross the boundaries for giving uh, the knowledge but thing is that what i expect what is the uh, guru dakshina which you are giving it to me is only just simple you have to come up write your exam qualify your exam tell me the news that yes i passed the exam or i have got a good opportunity that's all that is enough for that whatever is the relevant thing which is there in background i mean sir you teach this one you teach that one okay i'm there with with that but subjectively we are with a specific domain so we go through in that domains and then yes we have done that and we have to i have to see you all coming uh, uh, successful in the uh, upcoming uh, few days okay Anyway, thank you, Raven. Yes, anyone wants to add something else? Yes, you can add before the signal goes down. Yeah, very Sorry. much. Uh, yeah, very much. Thanks for all your information, like uh, the knowledge sharing. You know, it's just not one domain; like it's multiple domains, which is very rare to get. And uh, I really appreciate whatever you do. <laughs> you know, <laughs> you are doing to teach us, and uh, you know, really appreciate it. So uh, it's. it's a nice like a knowledge sharing thing okay. like what we do and uh, it's helpful like of our even the day and stuff like who are new to the other totally who have already experience but still understanding our classes are like a bread on the butter like it's so smooth and like uh, you you easily able to grasp the things okay yeah and it's just not one domain like not aws but you know people who teach they are only specific to that domain and only cover that area but 
your knowledge like uh, you know in networking or like other things as well definitely it's helping us to uh, okay. you know, get the Thank information you. all the perspectives yeah right, yeah right. really thanks for all your institute that was nice sai yes uh, uh, I, I, when i have students like you all definitely my energy levels always goes up so this is the batch i really enjoyed i tell you because the people who uh, like shashank or sai or raven yes i really not only that uh, some other members also yes they have gone through a uh, number of times i mean asking me questions uh, working across along with me certain things uh, which are the lab exercises i felt happy really the entire journey but for the members who has not followed up or who has not come across please do not lose hope see in my during my classes i may be a little bit tough okay even when i was working in the industry also people used to uh, be at least 2 or 3 feet before okay they never come near me uh, i don't know why they come up like that but i am always friendly i am always friendly they used to tell sir you are a tough person but when i ask you okay then should i tag yourself to other no sir we want to be with you only then why they only say that you teach us a lot you are tough but still you teach us a lot you know you make us uh, how to do on our own so that is one big thing sometimes we feel bad but definitely these things uh, will make us more elevated so i want everyone to be elevated because everyone has to stand on their own that is the ultimate goal for everyone so whatever technology i believe sincerely in that particular aspect so i should make you prepared i should make people not basically uh, gather people so this is how basically i make a lot of lot of uh, uh, friends across in the industry also the friend may be a small or big it's okay it's okay as long as we are in the technology the world is not very large okay we may meet each other we may see each other we may refer each other and then we can still have a win win kind of situation from among each other also that's how i learned many things from my students my students also we learned from you sir that is how win win so i i strongly believe in that wherever you are whichever place you are still we can be connected right anyone else finally before we conclude for today uh thank you very much sir for your guidance all the uh, classes together starting of the journey um, to all these classes in terms of uh, the knowledge sharing and everything it is motivating us to more to boost up the things going forward okay. uh, it's very helpful classes to me i can say right right thank you navin yes uh, i should also uh, tell you about uh, yes you should come up with a good career and of course not only uh, in the career aspect first of all i want everyone to clear the exam so whatever is the support needed you can definitely ask me suppose i'll tell you one more thing since i am also starting another batch from next monday tentatively we hope whenever we float it we normally get through in that but due to some circumstances if it doesn't then uh, please excuse me and whoever has not participated i tell you once again whoever has not participated any of the classes you can still uh, come into those classes okay just uh, ping me which of the classes you want to attend you can be part of that particular classes you need not pay an extra money in that only thing is that a slight notification is essential no sir i want to listen uh, about the starting uh, networking domain complete okay you can listen completely i don't have any objection in that okay this is for all not only for navi is this clear everyone yes sir okay yes. so if you want yes. beyond the recordings if you still want to participate yes you can have that kind of thing some members sometimes they uh, come at so that will build up your confidence also oh we are not outside we are not uh, away you we are still with the, the group which we have are still available and you can also connect me in linkedin also uh, we will be there in the group whatever is the notifications which are there uh, we can generally post across and since many of you are in different different domains if there are any openings or anything which are there just let me know i generally pass it to the students who are are interested it is a kind of uh, advantage for both they will get the resources known and they, they the members also get benefited out of that right yeah any other suggestions you want to say before we sign off for today i think uh, uh, we had a wonderful and excellent time uh, but still uh, this is not end this aw solutions architect whatever we have taught this is not end 
please uh, practice a lot and go through some of the services which you may not know also. So please go through. There will be a good number of services which you will be seeing in the due course. Uh, but the thing is that the confidence level which you have gained till now, that should cope up whatever the new services which you are going to deploy. Okay, if still if you are facing anything, maybe I can uh, suggest you some kind of notes or something like that. Or maybe if it is too uh, difficult, then I'll prepare a video and post it account. Like that, some people used to suggest me and then I prepared. It is uh, nothing big uh, rocket science. Uh, it's only a part of our uh, training uh, curriculum. Okay, so that's all from me uh, for uh, the last one month's training program. Uh, the, and I hope to see you all certified very soon. But, but before that, do complete all your Canvas exercises. And uh, any difficulties, please post. Uh, please uh, keep in touch with me. Our group is always there to help you. And then please start working on the exercises and the uh, dumps which are there. That will always be highly appreciated. And get yourself certified. Share the good news with me. Thank you, everyone. Thank you all for your time. And bye. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bye.